Hello everybody, welcome back to Cure for the Common Game. It's time for a quick video today. We're going to talk about Jasmine Boreal. <clears throat> now, in the set Legends that introduced Legends, there was a lot of cards that were, because they were experimenting with the idea of this legendary multicolor creature thing. And they wasn't sure how it was going to work. Now, back then, Wizards did the exact opposite of what they do now. They were too careful. As now, when they try something new, they break it the first time around and then you know, they fix it later. But anyway, so what I decided to do with Jasmine here is I was like, I, Miranda Petroglyphs was really what inspired it. I've liked this card since it, it did, since it came out in Future Sight, and I just wanted to build with it, but I thought, you know, it's just relying on vanilla creatures. And then I, I was, you know, stumbling around through one of the binders and I saw Jasmine Boreal and I went, wow. Yeah, five mana, four, five, period, end of story is not that good. So, to Miranda Patrick Lips, I thought, you know, what if it was just a basic thing? I mean, I kind of want to get her altered to where she's got like a, a, a mocha latte in her hand from Starbucks or whatever, so I can call her the base. Anyway, um, so what I did here was, you're looking at the only two cards that are, well, the only card that is not vanilla in the deck. All the lands are basic lands. And all the creatures are vanilla creatures. And it's just, you'd be surprised exactly how hard it is to find. Obviously, I'm not going over a lot of these because uh, they are just creatures with, you know, power, toughness, and mana. Uh, some of the flavor text is cool, whatever. But the it's not like uh, i think i only found one in each color in uh, a monket cuz i wanted to get the two uh, uh the a monket cards in there because let's face it i mean it's not like i'm doing anything special with it so creatures with no abilities it did kind of make me want to do a french vanilla um, I saw at the game shop uh, a couple months ago some Han Solo sleeves, which kind of made me want to do a tribal first strike deck, you know, and have the only, all the creatures in there have first strike because, you know, Han did shoot first. But, um, yeah, to vanilla creatures, there's nothing exciting here. I actually use this deck a lot as I'm, I bring it with me more than I play. I bring it because, hey man, I need a deck. I forgot mine. As punishment, here you go. Or, <laughs> yeah, that's mean. I know. But it's actually a really good teaching tool for those who are new to the game because it's kind of a process to teach somebody how to play Magic normally and then... Oh, then teach them how to play EDH. Okay, everything you learned, we're going to alter it. So so this is a, a decent, you know, it's one of, they're all vanilla creatures, there's nothing here, you're just playing dudes and swinging with dudes, and that's it. But that's what I've got. I call it Vanilla Wafers. Appreciate you watching. But right now, it's time to shuffle and cut. 